The Philippine Air Force chooses the Elbert Hermes 900 medium altitude long endurance unmanned aerial vehicle for their unmanned aerial system level 3 acquisition project under the Horizon 2 phase of the revised armed forces of the Philippines modernization program. The Hermes 900 once it becomes operational will become the most advanced unmanned aerial vehicle to the armed forces of the Philippines after they received the Hermes 450, and are expected to start arriving by 2020. The Philippine Air Force will receive a total of three complete Hermes 900 unmanned aerial system composed of three Hermes 900 unmanned aerial vehicles, also included a mission payload. Integrated Logistics System ILS, Technical Support, Ground Control Systems, and Support Equipment including training and other requirement. The whole package involves delivering a Hermes 450 unmanned aerial system from Elbert Systems Limited with four unmanned aerial vehicles, which arrived last year 2019. Among the incoming air assets, this already has partial delivery made earlier, and the rest of the orders will be coming in before 2020 ends. These UAVs are assigned with the 3031st Unmanned Aerial Reconnaissance Squadron of the 300th Air Intelligence and Security Wing. Hermes 900 and Hermes 450 were both acquired under the Philippine Air Force's Unmanned Aerial Systems Acquisition Project, a Horizon 2 phase priority project. It has an endurance of over 30 hours and can fly at a maximum altitude of 30,000 feet or 9,100 meters with a primary mission of reconnaissance, surveillance and communications relay. The Hermes 900 has a wingspan of 15 meters or 49 feet and weighs 970 kilograms or 2,140 pounds with a payload capability of 300 kilograms or 660 pound payload options include electro-optical infrared sensors synthetic aperture radar ground moving target indication communications and electronic intelligence electronic warfare and hyperspectral sensors under the unmanned aerial system level 3 acquisition project end user philippine air force of 300th air intelligence and security wing Quantity, 4 systems composed of 12 UAVs and supporting systems. Modernization phase, Horizon 2 phase of the revised armed forces of the Philippines Modernization Program. Approved budget for the contract. 8,470,000,000. Philippine Peso. For the whole project. Acquisition mode is government to government between. Philippines Department of National Defense. And Israel Ministry of Defense. Source of Funding, General Appropriations Act Funds, through AFP Modernization, Program Trust Fund, to be paid via, Multi-Year Obligation Authority Process. The winning proponent is Elbert Systems Limited. Contract Price, 8,470,000,000, Philippine Peso. The first Hermes 900 UAV delivered September 2019. First complete system of three Hermes 900 UAVs delivered as of December 2019. Two other systems with six UAVs is expected to be delivered before end of 2020. General characteristics. Crew 2 on ground. Capacity, 350 kg or 770 pounds payload. Length, 8.3 meters or 27 feet 3 inches. Wingspan, 15 meters or 49 feet 3 inches. Gross weight, 1,100 kilograms or 2,425 pounds. Power plant, one Rotax 914 engine with 86 kilowatts or 115 horsepower. Performance, maximum speed, 220 kilometers per hour or 140 miles per hour, 120 knots. Cruising speed, 112 km per hour or 70 miles per hour, 60 knots. Endurance, 36 hours. Service ceiling, 9,100 meters or 30,000 feet. The armed forces of the Philippines is investing heavily on unmanned platforms for surveillance purposes, as local terrorist is still the problem of the Philippines. The Philippine Air Force's 300th Air Intelligence and Security Wing 
also operates Cessna 208B X Grand Caravan ISR aircraft and three groups of Boeing Insight 2 Scaneagle 2 small UAVs. Scaneagle 2 is donated by the U.S. government to armed forces of the Philippines. Way back in 2018, before the year ends, six more Hermes 900 UAVs in two systems will arrive confirmed by Philippine Air Force, including other components and support equipment.